How y'all doing, man? I'm back with another video. I know you've been missing me. Um, everything been going the same way it always go as far as me working every day. We work. Um, having my cousin, having my nephew here has made things a lot easier. It made me a lot happier. And my daughter just brightens my life, period. But with that being said, my daughter has really bad allergies and asthma. So um, the dogs... Uh, the dogs are not allowed in the crib because her asthma flare up and that has been a chore having to redo everything having to just and I'm talking about it's been so tough y'all like so tough because like it's gonna be 100 this week it already felt like 100 yesterday like it's 95 degrees it's 90 degrees right now it's probably like 11 a.m. what time is it yeah, it's 11 a.m. It's like 90 degrees already. And it feels like 95, but it's going to be 95, 98. So it's going to feel like 105, all that type of shit. Listen, man, it's been crazy. So it's been it's been a chore, y'all. Um, having all these dogs that can't come in the crib that need to be in the crib because it's hot. But it's like, damn, daughter or dog. And as you guys know, nothing before my family, which my puppies are a part of my family as well, but I would never put my... My kid at risk, man, for having an asthma attack because of that. So over the last few days, we've went to urgent care. I had to buy a new asthma pump. I bought a breathing machine. I'm doing whatever I can. Um, Silver has, um, she's buying me a humidifier. Just humidify the whole room that she's in. I've been keeping my daughter isolated to my room only. Not to even come to the living room. And there's no dogs in the house, period. But I just, they've been in here so much. I fucking been here so much that I know they have hair everywhere. So I've been trying to just really clean the crib as much as I can to protect my kid, man. Um, it's been a, it's been hell, bro. It's been hell, but through all that adversity, man, I'm able to stay positive. I haven't been uploading videos, you guys, because I've just been taking care of business. And business come first. Last couple of days, I've been with my daughter completely. I haven't been around a dog, really doing no dog shit. I've been letting my nephew and my cousin handle it. I showed them what to do the first day they got here, and they've been they've been doing what they need to do, man. Um, it's a lot of things they missing out on doing, and half ass doing, which I don't appreciate. But nobody's gonna do the things the way you do it. So just because they're not doing it the way you do it, particularly, doesn't mean that they're not doing um, a good job or they're not doing the best that they that you know that they were gonna do as far as the effort they put in. Because at the end of the day, these are my dogs. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, bro. Um, so what I'm what I'm gonna do is, man. I still have a lot of puppies left, and it's gonna be 100 degrees this week. I need to get these puppies to a good home, man. So I'm gonna um, I'm gonna post pictures of the you know all the puppies you know here. I'm gonna let you guys see the little pictures, and later this evening I will show you guys the puppies. I just don't want to uh, rile them up because I go out there they're gonna get riled up, and it's too hot for them to be riled up. I need them to stay chill. They already in their cool spots. In the backyard, in the garage, they in their cool little spots. I need them to stay relaxed. Um, but I do got to go out there and clean up again. And we cleaned up around 6 this morning, man. Um, yeah, he cleaned up around 6 this morning. Um, but it, it's back, you know, it's back how it is. You know how it go, man. It's just a continued thing I have to do two or three times a day to keep the areas clean, to keep the dogs um, water and uh, fed and everything. It's been It's been a chore. But that's part of it, you guys. That's part of it. If you're interested in doing this, that's part of it. But what I am going to do, um, I'm not lowering my prices on my puppies. Um, I know for sure that they worked 10 times more than I got them priced for. But what I can do is offer guys um, a cheaper price to get the dog. And once you get your dog, get your money together, you want to come back and get the ABKC paperwork for me, you can do that. So all the mails that's available, I'm going to sell you guys the mails for $1,500. It does not include ABKC paperwork, okay? If you want ABKC paperwork, you got to pay a little bit more, man. You just, if somebody, this is for people that's not trying to breed. This is not people that's not trying to breed. This is for people that just want a quality dog, a beautiful, strong muscular, tall, big head, quality dog. This is only for those people. If you're trying to breed, you got to pay the full price, okay? 
So this is what I'm gonna do. Um, I have five meals available. It's fifteen hundred dollars a piece, man, to get you your mail to your house. Okay, that gets you your mail to your house. Ears already cropped, health certificate, up to date on shots, all that good stuff, man. All right. So I'm gonna post the pictures on here. This is just a short video to let you guys know I am recording more videos today. I am gonna get back in the swing of recording videos and show you guys the puppies how big they have got. They got. It's been, what, a few days since the last video? I promise you they got bigger since then. I promise you they have gotten bigger since then. This shit is crazy. I literally um, wake up to, like, a, a fucking bigger dog. Like, it's crazy. Also, another thing was going on. My chickens have officially started laying eggs. I, I can say eggs. So the other day I went out in the morning. And I opened up the fucking, where, you know, where they lay eggs at. And it was a brown egg, a beautiful brown egg. I still got it. I haven't cooked it yet. I want to wait till I get like five or six. So I can make a big breakfast with the, with the fucking eggs that I, that I, you know what I'm saying? I put in the work to get. So um, I'm going to vlog them and make a video of that. This page is my page. I know I turned it into like a full dog page, but my life is bigger than dogs, man. All right, so... If you subscribe to this page, you not only gonna get to see dogs, you're gonna get to see chickens, you're gonna get to see my family, my nephew, my cousin, my daughter, challenges, um, me and my daughter doing a challenge soon. Uh, you can see everything, man. I just kind of want to keep it that way. I don't want to have a bunch of different channels, man. Um, not right now. Maybe if we get to this, we get this to like two or three hundred thousand subscribers and um, then we start branching out to make new channels. I don't think my following is big enough to branch out to make another channel yet. Um, so we just got to get more in tune. We got to get back busier. Also, I'm taking all the boys to the gym today to work out to a boxing gym. So I went and bought boxing gloves. I should have recorded that. It's been a fucking, it's been some of the funniest shit in the world, bro, watching my nephew and my cousin box. It's so funny. I threw the gloves on, you know, um, just put in a little work with my nephew, man. I ain't want to hurt him. Um, but it's fun, man. It's one of the best workouts you can get. I, I got to give props to anybody that's out there boxing. Bro, you're different. You're different. It's not something you jump into. It's not. It, it's just not something you just can just do. This is. The sport of boxing is very technical, man. Very technical. It doesn't matter how strong you are. doesn't matter how how fast you are. This shit is technical. All right? So, yeah, we're taking the boys, taking my daughter. We're going to the boxing gym today to uh, kind of learn the, the, the techniques of this shit. And I will video record that, so that's going to be a video too, man. Everything is going to be on this channel, man. Everything, man. We're going to have this shit so fun. This channel's going to be so much fun, man. Make sure you like, come and subscribe. We'll throw a couple images up on the screen to let you guys see the pups available. But this is your time. All right, this is your time to get your dog. The summertime is here. The kids need somebody to play with. The kids need to enjoy dogs. You need to be outside taking your dog for a walk, growing with it, because they're growing fast. This is this is your time, man. Your time is now. Five hundred dollar deposit. Um, well, not doing deposit anymore, cause they of age and they up to they on shots ear cropped already. Give me the fifteen hundred dollars. Get you your dog. You want to breed? If you're interested in breeding. You got to pay an extra thousand on these dogs, man. Because, um, first off, they're going to be way bigger than Zeus. First off, their eyes are blue. First off, they're going to be taller, head bigger. They're just going to be a better version of Zeus and a better version of Nyla. Some you can't, you can't be. And you know it's bossy blood on both sides of my dog. I have some of the best blood in the game. 10000 8000 12000 Stud fees, blood is supreme. Blood is supreme. So, yeah, man, if, don't look no further, man. This is where you want your dog from, man. Also, I got two blue farms available. Um, I'm not saying the person on those two females are 1500 and that's where ABKC paperwork. You can't beat that. You can't beat that with a stick. I love y'all. Catch you guys in the next video.